Hello, it's Just Gaming here, and welcome back to another brand new series. And uh, this one is probably going to be one of the is going to be one of the interesting ones. So basically, I'm going to be starting a series where I don't have a house. And uh, if all of you do know that I do have a series on the second channel called the No Home Challenge, which is a series where I'm not allowed to have a home. But this one is a little bit similar to that. So, basically, you have a house, don't you? Uh, well, if you're in a real house. Uh, basically, houses and homes are a little bit different. So, house is, a, it is big, and a home is a home that's small. So, basically, this one is called the No House Challenge. And I know you might be thinking that I am copying the one from my second channel, the No Home Challenge. But house and home, they're a bit they're different. So basically, I'm going to be doing the same series on this channel without having a house. And I know it's exactly the same thing, but it's a bit different with a bit of a twist. So yeah, basically, it's called the No House Challenge. And what I've got to do, by the way, in this challenge is I'm not allowed to have a house and I've got to complete five challenges in the Let's Play. So uh, one challenge is I've got to get I've got to get three diamonds. So not just diamonds. Three diamonds. So well, it can, well it can be diamonds. Actually, no, we'll say diamonds, not three diamonds. I, I was joking there. So I've got to get diamonds. So I don't even know how many diamonds I've got. I bet it's got to be one, two, three. How many diamonds I can get? So I've got to get. Um, I've got to. Uh, I've got to get diamonds. Uh, the next one um, is um, uh, is I've got to reach the bottom of the world. So I've got to go and reach down to bedrock, which is which is going to be quite hard. So hopefully I'll be able to, to do that. Uh, number three, uh, um, I've got to battle the, the weather. So I've got to, to battle the weather without having a home. That's going to be pretty simple. Uh, the fourth one, I've got to battle the Ender Dragon. Pretty, pretty simple again. And the fifth one is I've got I've got to battle the Elder Guardian, which is going to be a little bit difficult because the Elder Guardian is pretty difficult, but I should be all right with that. So yeah, that, there are my five challenges I've got to do without having a house. That is the aim of it. Okay, so I've pretty much sorted all my settings out. I've got host on. I've got a normal world. Uh, I've got bonus chest on as well. And uh, and a texture pack we're going to be playing in is the natural one. And the reason I chose that one is because we've not done that one for a while. And since that, I only use it for the offline world. So yeah, that's that's one time to use like, that one again because we haven't used it. So we're playing on normal mode and we've got survival, the no homes challenge. But yeah, let's go and get into it. Let's go see how it goes. It should be pretty interesting though. I think it should be pretty, pretty cool. But yeah, let's get into it. And let's go and start my series called the No House Challenge. And uh, I can actually find stuff as well, but I'm just not allowed to live in it. So I've just got to keep moving forward. And that's why I put it on large mode, so I've just got a lot of the area. So uh, hopefully you guys really, really enjoy. And by the way, I won't be uploading it as a lot, by the way. I'm gonna, I'll try and get a, a lot of videos out on it, uh, but I just won't be uploading it uh, kind of a lot. So here we go. We have landed. And this is going to be my brand new world where I'm not allowed to have a house. And I think it looks pretty interesting at the moment. It's got a pretty much technique position. But yeah, it looks like pretty cool so far. And here is the bonus chest as well. Let's just go and just uh, dig into my uh, into my bonus chest. And there we go. Right, let's go see what stuff we're going to start off with. I'm just, I'm just going to get rid of the uh, torches first. Okay, right. Let's go see what we're starting off with. So it looks like that we're starting off with... Oh, we're starting off with a stone pickaxe and a stone axe. Pretty, pretty handy. Okay, let's go start grabbing all of this stuff from here. So it looks like I've got a map to do as well, which is pretty nice. Let's go and grab that. And we've also got the uh, the map as well. Right, so at the moment we are... Oh, looks like we're right down here. So we're actually not too far from the edge of the map. So we started off with it with a stone pickaxe. So I can actually uh, actually get uh, some cobblestone straight away. Just going to be kind of handy, but I'm not... But, uh, um, uh, because the first thing I'm going to do um, at every start of Minecraft series is I'm going to go and start off by getting some wood. Because that's going to be a really, really appreciated. So... I think I think for this episode, then I think we're just going to start off basically. We're just going to start off in the in the world. Uh, we're just going to basically get all our things that we need for the for the series. So, and we're going to start off by getting basically the things that we need for for the series. So, yep. Yeah, so that's what we're going to do for today. So we're basically starting off in the no home challenge uh, in the no <laughs> in the no house challenge. So yep, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. So let's go and start off by grabbing a whole lot of things as we can. Uh, uh, grab a lot of leaves, a lot of wood, and all that kind of thing. Uh, that I'm going to be able to uh, to get. So let's go and start off by getting uh, lots of uh, lots of trees. 
And yeah, when I've, when I, when I've got all this, I, uh, 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 yeah, I'm going to start moving forward, getting some animals, getting some, getting a bed, and all that kind of thing uh, that you start off in, uh, in Minecraft. So let's go and start off by uh, by just cutting out a whole other trees from here. Uh, so to be honest with you, though, there's, there's kind of not a lot of things to say about the challenge. Um, it's, pre it's pretty pretty simple. Uh, I came I came with, uh, with it myself, and I think it would be really cool to do it. So so yeah, hopefully it's going to be um. Yeah, it's going to be really cool. It's going to start off by just grabbing a whole load of wood as possible. And yeah, hopefully it's going to be it's going to be really really cool. There we go. It's going to start grabbing a whole a whole load of things from here. I'm, I'm not I'm not I'm, I'm not just going to grab oak. Uh, I'm going to grab uh, some birch as well. I'm going to try and grab as much wood as possible because uh, now that all of you do know that I can't grab it from my house. I can't make it like a tree farm or anything. So yeah, it's going to be a little bit difficult. But I mean to be honest with you, though, I think I should get the strategy. Hopefully, I should be able to work together um, if I can. So it's going to start off by getting uh, as much wood as possible. I'm going to get a little bit of the um, yeah of the birch. Um, as well, because I don't, I just, don't, I just don't want to grab oak. I want to grab like different sort of wood as well. So yeah, that's going to be uh, that's going to be very important as well. Right, looks like there, uh, there is some more birch down here. I'm going to try and grab like as much much of it as possible. So I think it's just going to be um, yeah, it's just going to be very important. So yeah, we've got we've got that one. I'm probably grab a little bit more, but I think apart from that, we should be completely fine for now. Um. I'm going to grab one more. I'm not sure how many birch we've got for now. Uh, yep, we've got 22 of that, and we've got 41 oak. Okay, that's fine. It looks like there's a sheep as well. I'm not going to really, really bother getting the sheep yet, because I haven't got a right of sword, but I'm just going to start grabbing some of these some of these plants. Pretty much important. I know that we don't need them, but they're pretty much important to be able to have. And I'm also just going to go and grab some seeds as well. I don't think we really need any... Um, any any flowers I don't think at the moment so I'm just gonna just grab us what's here since we are pretty much starting off like a tree's been burnt down as well like basically every single time I see wood on the floor it's like a tree's been burnt down I don't know why I've no idea what, what why that happens for some reason because every single time I always see a tree like I always see like wood lying about and it, it just kind of thinks that a tree's been like it has been burnt down and um yeah feels a bit weird but yeah, it's fine. Right, so we're, so we're heading uh, down at the moment, but I need to make sure I don't cross the map. But there's actually a bit of sugar cane here, so I might as well uh, start grabbing uh, some of the sugar cane. So I might as well just grab us as what we, as what we can, because like I said, I'm not allowed to, uh, to live in a house. So I might as well just grab as much as I can. But anyway, so, uh, since we, uh, we have got a lot of wood, let's go and start off by um uh, by making uh, a crafting table. And let's go and start off by, uh, by making uh, some, some tools, making some food and all that kind of thing. Um... Okay, right. We don't really need any of that. Um, I'm just gonna grab um, just what we need, basically. There we go. That that'll be fine. Okay, right. We've got all the stuff. Right then, here we go. We've got we've got our sword, and let's go and start off by uh, by grabbing some food. That's gonna be the next objective thing that we need to do. There we go. Right, let's go start getting some food because uh, because because basically food is going to be important for this series because like I said before, I can't cook the food. Well, I can cook the food, uh, but I just can't cook it in a house. So um, yeah, it's going to be interesting because basically I'm just not allowed to cook anywhere. Like only the place I can cook is either I can dig somewhere. Um, that that's basically another thing I can do. I can either cook somewhere. Um, or I can basically just cook it somewhere else. That, that, like that's under the two things I can do, and it is going to be difficult. So I need to do it like very, very wisely because if I don't, yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna be, yeah, it's, it, it's gonna be, um, yeah, it's, it's gonna be difficult. So I'll have to, I'll have to make it very, very wisely. I think, I think that's what I'm have to do because otherwise, if I don't, I'm otherwise going to kill myself, and I don't want to make it very, very wisely because. I know that I do the No Home Challenge version on, on on the bet together, and I know that you guys do know that I do hate that version because it's so confusing to be able to control of the mind and stuff. But I'm glad that I, I that I that I want to do this one on the on the on the other one uh, because I, uh, because I was thinking to do uh, to do this challenge on my second channel anyway, uh, but I wanted to do it on this channel because I didn't want to uh, I didn't want to do them both uh, do them both on both channels because. Basically, when I end up doing them both, I will be doing them different anyway. I will be doing um, uh, different stuff compared to this one. So this one will have, uh, will have a lot more differences compared to the other one. 
Um, so we'll be having a lot more differences on um, on this one. So basically, I'll be making them a lot more slightly um, slightly different uh, uh, as compared to the other ones. Um, uh, so yeah, that's what's going to be happening, by the way. So I'll, I'll be doing them a lot more different. And my, my pockets are full. Are you joking me? My pockets are full already. That is that is not right. I've only been in the world for for ten minutes, and my pockets are full already. They they definitely need to sort this updated pockets because I've no idea why I've got that many pockets already. I can literally not believe I've got like I've got full pockets already. I have no idea why I've got full pockets already. I have no idea why I've got full pockets, but I don't really care. Right, let's go and start grabbing uh, some some cobblestone. I'm not going to stay here too long because, like I said, I don't want to mine us too much of it. Yeah, like I said, I don't want to mind too much of it. Yeah, I don't want to mind too much. Hunger grab is too much. Not a lot of cobblestone anyway. Not going to grab us too much without cobblestone anyway, which is going to be very important. There we go. Right then. There we go. Right, we've grabbed a few more things. Uh, oh, looks like there's some coal over there. Like, this is, like, pretty much the easiest thing that we need. Like, I know it's going to get a little bit harder because I know we can't live without a home. So, uh, I know it's going to get a little bit harder. But, to be honest with you, though, I don't think it's going to be too bad. I think we should be okay in this, this challenge. I don't think it's going to be too bad, though, compared to what we're going to be doing and all that. I don't think it's going to be too bad. I actually guarantee I don't think it's going to be too bad. I think it should be fine. It might it might be too bad. It might be completely bad, but I I actually guarantee it won't be. I guarantee we'll probably do it really very easily. To be honest with you, I don't I don't know how easily, but I believe we are going to do it pretty, pretty easily. And uh, I don't I don't mean probably by really really easy. I mean by which we're probably just going to do it in a pretty good success. Um, so that is probably how difficult we're probably going to do it. I think. Probably, I, I, I don't know, but I'll have to go and probably let you know. But Right then, let's go and keep moving on. I'm going to try and explore the world as much as possible. Because uh, I said from before that we can't build anything. So, oh, looks like we found some pumpkins. Uh, so yeah, we can't even build as much, but um, it's fine. Um, at least there's a few things we can grab while we're here. Especially these pumpkins. We can start grabbing some of these. Oh, oh there's a lot, a lot of pumpkins over here. Start making some pumpkin pie. That's going to be a lot more important. I got managed to get myself nine pumpkins from there. That's going to be very, very important. Let's go and keep going in this direction. So at the moment we are heading north now. Uh, oh, it looks like there's looks like there's a nice area here. Look at this area here, completely flat over here. So we've got we've got a completely big flat area here. I've been thinking I might build my home here. I think that was quite cool. Since it's quite a nice flat area, but like like I basically like to explore a little bit more. But uh, yeah. But yeah, like I said, I can't, I can't build a home, which is kind of another problem. Like, basically, I usually see, like, like quite a lot of land area, and then I just can't build on it. It's just it's just so annoying. Like, I can, I can grab stuff, but I just can't really build on it, and it's just really, really annoying that I just can't build stuff. It's really annoying that I just can't build stuff. Like, I can build things, but I just, I just can't build a home, and it's just, it's just really, really annoying that I just can't build what I want, and, um, yeah... Right, right, it's getting night time by the way now, so we do need to be careful. So I need to get myself one more sheep. If I get myself one more sheep, and then I'll be able to make a bed completely as quickly as possible before it gets to night vision. And that's what I need to do. Right, what I'm going to do by the way is my hunger is going down. If I can get one... Oh, here we go. Yep, yeah, there's one more sheep. Right, let me just get this sheep. Now what I'm going to do by the way is I'm just going to go and hide into a corner because my hunger is going down. Right, I'm just going to go and just start hiding here. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to go and start off by making some things. Because otherwise I'm going to kill myself and we don't want that happening. So I'm just going to go and make myself just a little bit of a thing in here. Because like I said from before, I don't want to I don't want to kill myself out there. So, right then, let's go and start off by um, by making myself my furnace. So that's going to be very important. Let's go and start making a furnace then. Okay, right, let's go and start making, start making that. Okay, let's go and put that on, on there. Right, let's go start off by uh, by starting to make my uh, my food. 
who are much in progress, so that I can't cook anything at the moment. But yeah, I think it's going to be interesting though. I know that some of the challenges are going to be difficult, but I think to be honest with you, I think some of the challenges will be pretty, pretty easy. I, I, I guarantee I don't think there will be though, but I actually guarantee that the challenges should be really, really easy. I don't know. I don't know how easy it's going to go. I, I don't know how easy it's going to it's going to be. I don't know, but I actually guarantee it. I bet it's going to be really easy to, to gather everything. I'm I'm not totally sure about it though, but I guarantee it is going to be really easy to gather stuff. And I know that I might be a little bit might be a little bit compact on that, but I think it's going to be really really easy to gather stuff. And uh, I might be I might be improving it wrong, but I think I think it's probably going to be easy. And I might be improving it wrong at the moment but i think it's going to be really easy to gather stuff and uh, you might be thinking that i might be wrong on that situation but i think it is going to be really easy to be able to gather stuff that you want and getting a lot of food because the most thing, the guarantee that's going to be a lot of worrying is, is going to be the food situation because at the moment i can make a farm but i can't make it as an as in a home farm i can only make it as like a de designated farm and basically the problems about it as well is it's going to be a little bit difficult to, to mine it as well and also gather it from from animals and stuff because like i can't make anything that i need so i know that, i know that the food strategy is probably going to be one of the the worst nightmares ever i don't think it's going to be too bad to get our food though um to be honest with you i don't think it's going to be too bad to get our food um i think that i think probably the strategy are probably going to be struggling uh, struggling on about about getting food it's getting all our animals and that is going to be a lot bit of a nightmare so it might not be as difficult to be able to get a lot of food i don't know how, how difficult it's going to be but i actually guarantee it, it might be very easy to get all the food especially getting getting the farm because because we definitely need a village in this world we definitely need to get myself a village so hopefully there is going to be a village because I've put the world on large. So hopefully there's going to be a lot of villages by because I will be exploring the, uh, the, the 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 desert maps anyway. We'll be exploring a lot more of the maps so I can be able to find a lot of villages because that's going to be the most important thing we need to be able to to find so we can get a lot a lot of stuff there. Um, and hopefully that is going to be really really good if we can be able to get um a lot of stuff from there. Um, and uh, yeah. Hopefully it's going to be really easy to be able to like gather a lot of food that we can be able to to have and all that. Um, I don't know how uh, how difficult it's going to be. It might it might be really difficult. It might be really easy. I don't I don't really know. But hopefully it's going to be really easy. That's that's what I that I am going to say at the moment. Um, and yeah, hopefully it's going to be um it's going to be really cool. But yeah, I'm I'm just going to just cook all this food and then and like I said, I, um, I'll be all ready to start heading out. Um, I've got my bed by the way, so I might as well start making my bed while I'm here. There we go, let's go and just go and make that. I'm going to just go and put that here for now. There we go. Right, let's just go and sleep here. And then we can just go and carry on in the um in the morning. Oh, ow. There we go. Let's go and gather that. Okay, there we go. Right, all my food has been cooked. Right, have I got enough pockets, by the way? I might just chuck some away here. I might just chuck some away here. There we go. There we go. Right, I think I should have enough room now. Got seven coal left, that's fine. Because now, like I said from before, we'll be getting some more coal on the journey anyway, so that'll be completely fine. Okay, right. I don't I don't think it's daytime yet, I don't think. Um Oh, it is daytime. Hey, it is daytime. Okay. Yeah. Well, I slept I slept tonight. So yep, it is daytime now. Okay. Oh, there's an enderman. Okay. Right then, let's go and uh, start heading my way forward then. It looks like there's kind of a lot of patch on this area, but it looks like there's still no village at the moment. It looks like there is still no village, but we are doing quite well. And there is uh, a few more pigs over here. There's a bit, a bit more sugarcane as well, which is going to be very important. We'll just start grabbing some of that. I think I've just seen a little bit more coal over there, so I'm going to start grabbing a little bit more of that as well. Yep, there is a lot bit more coal over here. So we'll start grabbing some of that. Let's start grabbing some of this coal. There we go. Now let's just start grabbing a little bit more. There we go. There we go, that's fine. Now well, I've got a little bit more coal as I just get myself stuck. There we go. But yeah, this, this world's looking quite good. It's looking pretty... Pretty nice world so far. I think this world is looking pretty good. It's actually looking a pretty nice world actually. I thought the world would have not been too great, but it's uh it's looking a pretty nice world so far. 
Not looking too bad though. Not looking too bad to be honest. It's not looking a too bad world. As to be honest with you, anyway, it's not looking too bad, but but yeah. It's like a pretty landscape world to be honest with you. It's not looking too bad. Let's go and head up this way. And we've pretty much explored most of the world so far though. Compared when we when we ended up starting, it's not looking too bad, but well, let's keep going. Can I spot a village about? I can't see a village at the moment. Oh, well, there is a desert biome over there, so there might be a village somewhere, but... Can't see a village at the moment. <gasps> Let's go and climb this mountain. Let's see if we'll spot anything up here. But I guarantee we're probably not, but... Let's see if we're going to find anything up here. Don't think we probably are, but... There's going to be a lot of things up here we're probably going to be able to find. It's kind of a few things that we're probably going to be able to find. Not looking too bad though the world, but this mountain's looking quite good. The way how I can look at this mountain from a view, but that's looking quite interesting from here. Mountains don't look too bad. There's kind of a lot of mountains, but a lot of water as well. That's looking quite good. It's looking a pretty nice world actually. Don't feel too bad. It's like an open sort of a world, so it don't look too bad, but yeah. Looks pretty pretty cool actually. Looks pretty pretty cool. Got stuff and all that kind of thing. I know dirt is gonna be mostly for the series, so I might as well start grabbing some of this because I I think the most important block that we're gonna be able to use is probably dirt. Because that's gonna be the most important thing. Yeah, dirt is going to be the most important thing that we need. Um, I think pro probably everything else that we probably need for it is probably not everything that we need, but there's going to be a lot of stuff that we probably need, like wood and all that situation and stuff like that. But, um, yeah. Like flowers and all that kind of thing that we probably need as well, and all that kind of thing that we probably need. But, importantly, to be honest with you, though, I don't think it's going to be too bad uh, to work until we end up starting this, but I think it's probably going to be really good. I think I think I'm going to really, really, really enjoy it. This uh, this uh, this no house challenge. I know it's I know it's a bit uh, a bit different than uh, than the no home challenge, but uh, I think it's going to be uh, really really cool. So um, as yeah, guys, I think I'm probably going to end it. I think I think I think this has probably been a good success to end my first episode here of the no house challenge. I think it's been a good start. I uh, I've started to grab a, a, a lot of things, which is which which probably what we needed and. Hopefully that the next episode is going to be um going to be really cool. So yeah, so, so yeah, uh, that that's been the end of the no house challenge. So I know it's been a bit similar than the no home challenge, but I'm not, I'm going to try and do a little bit similar uh, than what I'm doing that one. But hopefully uh, that's going to be really really cool. But um yeah, that has been uh, basically the no house challenge. So yeah. Hopefully uh, you guys are going to really enjoy this series of me wandering about uh, without having a house, which is hopefully going to be the other thing I'm going to be able to uh, to do. So, yep, so next episode I'm going to stop wandering about a little bit more. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might go maybe explore the world in the next one. I don't know what I'm going to do. I know it's going to be a little bit weird uh, without me building a house, but hopefully there is going to be a lot of things that I'm going to be able to, to do. And uh, make, make sure you do stick for it, guys, and hopefully you guys are going to really, really enjoy it of me not building a house. But... It should be interesting, but hopefully it's going to be uh, really good. But yep, hopefully you guys are going to really enjoy it. So yep, episode 2 of the new house challenge will be on very, very soon. And I'll carry on, and uh, I'll probably go and explore the world, but I don't know. But hopefully you guys enjoy it. So yep, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye!